Hello everyone, welcome to default Drupal channel. Today we are going to see about how to print variable inside your pick template file. I already created custom theme here. I already posted video about how to create custom theme. And in this theme, I am overriding a theme of Olivero here. And I was overriding only the page.html.pick file from the Olivero. And here I have a pick template file. Here I am going to print the variable, whatever we are getting in this particular pick template file. For that, you have to mention like uh, in you can print it anywhere in your pick uh, template file, the dump function. So dump function will print the complete variable, whatever you are getting for this particular uh, quick template file. So once then, go, go to your website and clear your catchy. Now you will be able to see the complete variable which you are getting for that particular quick template will be printing here. And you can uh, open and check each variable, okay? And next, when you want to print particularly any particular variable, like when you want to print only header, so you can pass variable here like page dot header. So you can see under page, we are, uh, we are having header. So I'm mentioning like page dot header. In, con in this condition also, you can see it's page dot header. And then go and clear the catchy. I didn't disable catchy for uh, tweak templates. So if you... Disable means you don't need to clear the catchy. So once catchy clear, you will be able to see, you, you can see only the value of the header element. And if you want to print only the key values, which is available for this particular trick template, you can put like underscore context, pipe symbol, keys, save it and go and clear the catchy again. So you can get now all the key value which is available for this particular trick template, okay? So these are the ways you can use to uh, print the variable which is available in the core. You can do one more way. You can enable a devil module. So composer require Drupal slash devil. Download the module. And then uh, go to extend and enable the module. So once this is downloaded, you have to download one more com uh, module, Composer Require Drupal slash Devil Kint Extra. Okay. So which is Devil Kint Extra, this one. So copy the name and download that module. Once the module is downloaded, go and enable that. Now go to your extends. In extend, enable the module of devil kit extra. So this will automatically enable the devil module. Now the module is enabled. Now go to your uh, home page again. And in your pick file, you can print kint instead of this. And then uh, clear the catchy again. So you will be able to see the complete value is displaying in kint with the help of kint function. And you can remove this argument. And then you can clear again. And now you will be able to see the complete uh, variable element. And as like I said, you can print a variable inside it. Uh, these are the ways you can use to uh, print a variable inside your Twig template file. And that's it about today's video. If you like the video, please share, like, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye.